Hello all, this is the fourth problem of our vector addition. Before I start this exercise, I'd like to invite you to subscribe on this channel and like this video. Now let's go to the, our exercise. The guy wires I used to support the telephone pole represent the force in each wire in Cartesian vector form, neglect the diameter of the pole. So first, we need to find our position vector. I will start with our force A. So my position vector A to C is equal minus 1 minus 0 I because this is the distance from the X here. Now the distance of Y is 4 meters. So plus 4 minus 0 j plus and here I have 0 because I'm on the ground minus and I started here with a 4 meter height so 0 minus 4 k so our position vector AC is equal minus 1 I plus 4 J minus 4 K. Our second step is find the magnitude of the position vector AC. So I have the square root of minus 1 square plus 4 square plus minus 4 is square. So I know that my magnitude of my vector RAC is equal 5.74. Now I can find my unit vector. My unit vector UAC by definition is the position vector that I have, that's our RAC, divided by the magnitude of the vector AC. So in my unit vector AC is equal minus 1 over 5.74 I plus 4 divided by 5.74 j minus 4 divided by 5.74 k. So my unit vector AC is equal minus 0.174 i plus 0.696j plus, sorry, minus, minus 0.696k. Now I'm going to find my force in Cartesian vector. So to find my vector force A, I need to take the magnitude of FA that's given by the exercise and multiply by my unit vector AC. So I have the Cartesian form of my force A is 250 newtons times my unit vector AC from the last slide minus 0.174 I plus 0.696 j minus 0.696 k. Now we have our Cartesian vector form of my force A that is minus 43.5 i plus 174 j minus 174 k. So this 
is our first force factor in our Cartesian form. Now, to find the second one, we have to redo our steps. So the first step is find the position vector R, B, D. So here I have 2 minus 0 I plus minus 3 minus 0 J plus 0 minus 5.5 K. So my vector position vector R B D is equal to I minus 3 J minus 5.5 K. The unit is meters. Now, our second step is the magnitude of my position vector BD. So I have the square root of 2 square plus minus 3 square plus minus 5.5 square. So here in my magnitude I have 6.58 meters. Now, our third step is the unit factor BD is equal. The vector BD divided the magnitude of BD. So my unit vector BD is equal. 2 divided by 6.58 I minus 3 divided by 6.58 J plus, sorry, minus 5.5 divided by 6.58 K. Unit vector BD is equal 0 0.304 I minus 0 0.456 J minus 0 0.836 K. To finish our problem, I have the Cartesian form of my force vector B is the magnitude of B times unit vector BD. So I have my force vector B is equal 175, that's my magnitude, times 0 0.304 I minus 0 0.5 4, 5, 6, J minus 0 0.836 K. So the final answer for our magnitude for our vector form B is 53.2 I minus 79.8 J minus 146k. So this is our final answer for my Cartesian vector form B. If you watch me from here, thank you for your participation.